All right, Shalom. First off, I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shah, by Hashem Rakak I want to give double honors to the apostles and the others of Great Millstone. And this is Sir Shalom to all the Akim out here that's doing and pushing the work in truth and in sincerity. Okay, I'm going in on this uh, topic of, um, you know, basically Esau uh, can't make it. Okay, I um, mean, there's a lot of scriptures on that uh, subject. Okay, um, see, the thing is that a lot of people don't understand that a lot of the scriptures that are in the Old Testament haven't happened yet, you know, and they have this uh, crazy idea that, um, you know, it's all about the New Testament, where if, if you just went by the New Testament, you wouldn't um, understand the Bible at all, okay, which a lot of these people don't understand the Bible at all, okay, who just say it's all about the New Testament. Okay, uh, I'm gonna just go ahead in the scriptures. Okay, because Esau, the so-called white man, okay, is um, he, he's not he, he can't be saved. Okay, this is uh, Isaiah 34 and 5. My sword shall be bathed in heaven. Okay, now you gotta ask yourself. Okay, when did a sword ever get bathed in heaven? Okay. It's talking about nuclear missiles, okay? It says, Behold, it shall come down upon Idumia, okay? And when you go into the word Idumia, okay, you see it says Edom right here, okay? Idumia, okay, is the Greek way of saying uh, Edom or Esau, okay, which means red, okay? Or ways of the way is he, okay? Um... It says, uh, Edom, Edomite, Idumian, descendants of Esau. Okay, land of Edom, okay, Idumia, land south and southeast of Palestine. Okay, now, you got to ask yourself, when did this ever happen? If it ever happened, okay, there should be some type of, um, uh, you know, historical proof to prove that this happened okay the thing is that it didn't happen yet okay it says and upon the people of my curse to judgment okay and it's a curse to look like the so-called your obey edomite okay not having any pigmentation it says the sword of the lord is filled with blood it is made fat with fatness and the blood of lambs and goats with the fat of the of the kidneys of rams for the Lord have a sacrifice in Basra and a great slaughter in the land of Idumia. Okay? Now, Idumia actually exists. Okay? You have to you have to show in history, okay, when this actually happened, man. Okay? Isaiah, Ezekiel 35 and 15. As thou didst rejoice at the inheritance of the house of Israel because it was it was desolate. Okay, here in America, the so-called white man, okay, they they love the idea that our people are in a, um, the condition that they're in, okay, and they um, you know they 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 just love it, man, you know, and they they uh they they you know they take pictures and you know homeless people, you know, it says because it was desolate, so will I do unto you. Thou shalt be desolate, O Mount Seir, and all Idumia, even all of it, and they shall know that I am the Lord. Okay, so the Lord is going to destroy all, okay, of the, the areas that the so-called white man lives in, okay? He's going to make them uh, desolate, okay, and put them in slavery. Ezekiel 36 and 5. Therefore, thus saith the Lord God, Surely in the fire of my jealousy have I spoken against the residue of the heathen and against all Idumia, which have appointed my land into their possession with the joy of all their heart. Okay, and it's talking about the, the land of, uh, of Israel. Okay? Because the people who live over there in and uh 
in the land of Israel are not uh, Israelites, okay? They're, they're Edomites, okay? Revelation 3 and 9, Behold, I will make them of the synagogue of Satan, which say they are Jews and are not, and do lie. Behold, I will make them to come and worship before your feet, and to know that I have loved you, okay? And that hasn't happened yet, okay? So, it says, Which have appointed my land into their possession, with the joy of all their heart, with despiteful minds, to cast it out for a prey. Okay? Uh, Isaiah 63 and 1. Who is this that comes from Edom, with dyed garments from Basra? That, I mean, this that is glorious in his apparel, traveling in the greatness of his strength. I that speak in righteousness, mighty to save. Okay, and this is the one who the world ignorantly calls Jesus, okay, which his name is Yahweh Shah. Okay. It says, Wherefore art thou red in thy apparel, and thy garments like him that treadeth in the wine fat? I have tried in the wine press alone, and of the people there was none with me. For I will tread them in mine anger, and trample them in my fury, and their blood shall be sprinkled upon my garments, and I will stain all my raiment, okay, and this is, when you go into the word Basra, okay, first off, it gave you, it gave it away when it said Edom, okay, but Basra, modern day Basra is America, okay, or anywhere where so-called white man Esau uh, resides, okay, Basra means sheepful and was a pastoral a city in Edom, southeast of the, the Dead Sea, according to the Hebrew Bible, it was the city, capital city of Edom, in the homeland of Jacob's twin brother Esau. Now, you have to you have to go once again in the history. And so, when the heck was it just one one uh, person that went into East Edom, okay, and killed everybody, and there was nobody with him, okay? It says, and their blood shall be sprinkled upon my garments, and I will stain all my raiment. For the day of vengeance is, is, is in my heart, and the year of my redeemed is come. Okay? And that's the year of his people. Okay? Who is teaching this truth. Okay? And that the so-called white man ain't going gonna to make it. Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. The, that bloodline, okay, or lineage is, is the, the, uh, the biblical Israelites. Okay? That uh, his name isn't Yahweh Shah, okay? That the Most High, his name isn't Yahweh. I mean, his name is Yahweh, Salakia, okay? So these are the people that are teaching the truth that, you know, the mark of the beast is the RFID chip, okay? So why is the Lord going to have vengeance on the so called white man? Because the white man thinks that he's God, okay? And that's in the scriptures, okay? In uh, 2 Thessalonians, the second chapter. Okay? But with that, man, you know, I want to say uh, Shalom.